What's up? So today is a different type of day. What we're doing is something that I haven't done in a long while. If you've seen some of my previous videos, you'll notice that I've went on a thing called geocaching. So what it is, is there's tiny little trinkets, or bigger ones, or larger ones, that are hidden around. There's a secret map, but I can't really tell you exactly where they are. I might show you what's in them, but we're gonna go do a geocaching day. It's been a long time since we got to do them. I got some people along with me. This one should be fun. As you can notice, I'm like super, I have like lots of frame to play with today, because I got a lens of a wider lens, so it's like super wide. I can't even fit my, oh, wait. there we go, further back, smaller, yeah. I get that. So we're gonna go try find our first cache. Let's go do this. See us in a few. Woo! On the way to cache numero uno. And look at this. This this is like a beautiful view. Hey, there's Chris again. Hi Chris. Chris gave me a land of this lens. It's super wide. Chris has a wide, but he doesn't have a super zoom. I'll let you make up the jokes. I don't think I've ever used a lens this wide before. It's beautiful. Look, all of the nice scenery. Hello, a person in car. Are we, are we going through a toll? I have no change. Anybody have any change? We got through the toll without them asking us for money. Good, because I had none. Um, but look at this view. This Dublin Docklands. And I would show you where we're going, but it's like so, so far away that the camera won't see that far. <laughs> All the way out here, I think it's just this is a little red boat and it's just past that. So we need to get there. Let's keep going. So, yeah, we're gonna keep walking. We've a fair way to go. I think we clocked it at a total. It's basically where we were in like three videos ago when we went to fly the drone. It's like six and a half kilometers. So, we have a long walk. It's gonna take us a while to get there. But pick it up on the way. So I'll tell you a little something about this cache that we're going to. There is five stages. So the first one basically it's a multi-cache. So what it does is the first one gives you a clue to the second one. Second one gives you a clue to the third one, and you can see where this is going. But there's one thing about it that they've said to remember things. So there's a clue of like, make sure you get the number for this, because the coordinates for the last one needs these digits. So it'll probably be a bit of a challenge, a bit of a brain buster. Nothing like a brain buster thing first thing in the morning. Keep us going. So we're still on our way to the first. We've taken some random back road somewhere and I, I genuinely don't know where we are so if you don't see the rest of this video something has happened to us call my mama somebody please call my mama Chris just found me a new camera bag check this out free alcohol this bag looks smashing so the wind is starting to pick up a bit the audio will probably be a bit but we'll fight on it's starting to drizzle a little bit of rain, never killed anybody, but it might kill my camera, so I'm going to put it away for now. There's a fence here. Just give me a second. <laughs> oh, we're here. Oh, this is where we were the last time. Oh, is this where we're going to fly the drone? Oh, this is where we flew the drone the last time. Did you not say it's a bit windy, Chris? Here we can. Up here? Fuck it. We'll see it. Fuck it. Is there uh, a... How much worth of a Euro drone is this and you're saying fuck it? Like it? <laughs> we'll see how this goes. So, Chris, do you really think this is a good idea to fly the drone? Look at your screen. <laughs> Look at the water on your screen. I'm cleaning. <laughs> lots and lots of water. How's it going, Chris? Updates. Are you sure this is a wise choice?
she needs a hook. Hug the camera. So we finished some drone flying. We're about 200 meters away from cache number one of five. Uh, when I get there, we'll explain a little bit more because I probably don't have a clue until I see all the details about exactly what it is. Okay. <laughs> Important issues. We play Pokemon Go. No, There's no. a raid here. I don't. We're gonna do the raid. <laughs> don't play Pokemon. Chris doesn't, so he's just gonna stand here and watch us. What's what's up with your hair? I think that's probably. Put your glasses up. Hey, hey that's we're gonna do raid. So we're about five minutes walk away from our first cache of five. Um, we stopped off for a while, got a raid. Ah. Oh, we're coming to a road that we can't kind of see. <laughs> yeah, we're going five minute walk away. We're going to get this first one out of the way because we've wasted, I think, how much? How long of time? About two hours of doing nothing? Yes. Saying we were going to get the cash. So, yeah, let's go get this first cash. Get this day actually doing what we set out to do. Seven hours later. Actually, before we get there, for all you geocacher people, um, don't worry, I'm not going to show you exactly where the cache is. Um, I might show you what's in it if there's anything interesting, if it's not like a little micro cache. Um, I won't give you the exact uh, details of what the next clue is. I'll let you find that out yourself. Keep watching and you'll find out. So, this is our first clue this great big ball. Take note of Hope the Lighthouse for our next clue. All these clues are in the description of what is on the actual geocaching website. Don't know if you can hear me if it's quite windy or not. We need to take down numbers for the looks of the coordinates for the last one. So So we figured out our next waypoint. This guy figured it out. Hi Chris. Um, so I'm gonna move over here, give you more room. You can come in here, Chris. Um, so we're gonna move on to our next cache. So that's cache 105? Uh, yeah, there's five clues to get to the final cache. Five clues to get to the final. We're one down, moving on to the next one. Let's keep going. <laughs> Fairly, I'm in a bit of an alcove of wind, um, so you might not be able to hear me properly. But we're at part two, we're gonna move on forward. There's Rosie, hi Rosie. Um, gonna move on to part three and hopefully get there before we get blown off this pier. She's still waiting. So we've made it up to the tower. In the tower, we have clues three, four, and five. Sorry, not the tower, the lighthouse. This isn't like Lord of the Rings or something. Uh, so with the lighthouse we have three, four, and the main cache is five. We're after figuring out three and four, and then we just have to find the cache. It's a bit tricky, but we're trying to do the math, and none of us are very good at math. It's a bit awkward. So I've just been told that all of our math has been wrong. We've been doing it in the wrong metrics, let's say. Whatever that means. Right. I don't know math, I don't do math. Um, so we're gonna go try find it, and maybe I'll show you what's there. We'll see in a minute. Holy shit. 
So we found out where it is. Nobody's happy. But we gotta go get it. We're going that way anyway. I'm not gonna tell you exactly where it is. Because then you won't all walk all the way up here. It is beautiful, beautiful sight. Back down we go. windy right now I found a little nice corner to sit in um, I don't want to show you too much around the area because it'll probably give away exactly where the cache is so it was a trek we made it we're gonna go find the cache and show you what's in it all the math I'm walking has given me like a serious headache I think we're gonna go grab some food after this I think that'd be a great idea <laughs> let's go get that cache we found it, Joe found it. Again, I'm just gonna stay exactly where I am so I don't ruin where the actual cache is. Give me a sec, I'll just go up and show you. What do we got? Ooh, lots of paper, lots of clean paper. Yeah, it's brand new. It looks like someone from Germany. A few Irish names. A few Irish names there. It's recently been updated. We're only the eighth person to find it this year. What? Super camo. I don't know how people even make these things. Let's just pop that back in the tub. It's cool, it looks like a bottle cap. Then we gotta hide it. Whoop! Make sure muggles can't find it. So we found the cash, we are all tired. And we are hungry. Who's up for burritos? Burritos! Two hands! Yes! I'm gonna go get some food. We're all getting tired and grumpy and narky and hangry. Hangry. Let's go get some food! How are we feeling now that we're all fed? I'm so tired. Good. Yes. Yes, please. <laughs> Give me my coffee. <laughs> my coffee got stolen. He's got a coffee assistant. Oh, yes. yes. Uh -huh. Thank you. So I'm going to finish this video off with one of the most sexiest bridges in Dublin. So. Peace. See you in the next one.